to the Financial Times right before arriving here was that Western style liberalism is obsolete. I know you, you, you probably haven't read the interview. Well, again, he may feel true? that way. I mean, he sees what's going on, and uh, I guess if you look at what's happening in Los Angeles, where uh, it's so sad to look, and what's happening in San Francisco and a couple of other cities, which are uh, run uh, by a, an extraordinary uh, group of liberal people. I don't know what they're thinking, but he does see things that are happening in the United States that uh, would would probably preclude him from saying how wonderful it is. At the same time, he congratulated me as every other every other leader of every country did for what we've done economically, because we probably have the strongest economy we've ever had, and that's a real positive. But uh, I'm very embarrassed by what I see in some of our cities, where the politicians are either afraid to do something about it, or they think it's votes, or I don't know what, Peter, I don't know what they're thinking, but when you look at Los Angeles, uh, when you look at San Francisco, when you look at some of the other cities, and not a lot, not a lot, but you don't want it to spread. and. Uh, at a certain point, I think the federal government maybe has to get involved. We can't let that continue to happen to our cities. Uh, 